Rivaldo Bartol Borba Ferreira, known as Rivaldo, is a former Brazilian professional footballer and the current president of Moji Mirama Sporty Clube in Brazil. He played as an attacking midfielder and sometimes as a second striker. He spent five years with Spanish club FC Barcelona, where he formed a successful partnership with Patrick Cluivert, and won the 1998 and 1999 Spanish La Liga Championship and the 1998 Copa del Rey. Between 1993 and 2003, Rivaldo played 74 matches and scored 34 goals for Brazil and is the seventh highest goal scorer. He helped Brazil reach the final of the 1998 FIFA World Cup, and won the 1999 Copa Armour copyright Rica where he was named player of the tournament. Rivaldo starred alongside Ronaldo and Ronaldinho in the 2002 FIFA World Cup winning team. He was named in the FIFA World Cup All-Star team in 1998 and 2002. One of the most skillful players of his generation, Rivaldo was renowned for his free kicks, overhead kicks, ball striking from distance, dribbling, passing and close ball control. In 1999 he won the Ballon d'Or and was named FIFA World Player of the Year. In 2004 he was named in the FIFA 100 list of the world's greatest living players. He is an inductee to the Brazilian Football Museum Hall of Fame. In March 2014, Rivaldo announced his retirement from professional football. Early life, born in Paulista, Pernambuco, Brazil, Rivaldo had a poor upbringing in the favelas of the port town of Recife. His physical appearance still marks the poverty he experienced in his childhood, malnourishment caused bowleggedness and the loss of several teeth. Predominantly left-footed, Rivaldo began his professional career at the age of 16, when he signed with Paul Lestano Futebol Club in 1989, despite the Paul Lestano coaches believing him too physically weak to succeed. Rivaldo's father Romildo was killed in a road accident in 1989, but Rivaldo signed his first professional contract later that year. Club career, Santa Cruz, Moji Miram and Corinthians, he went on to play for Santa Cruz in 1991. In 1992, he moved south to the state of Sao Paulo do Paulo where he played for Moji Miram in the second tier of Brazilian football. In 1993, he moved to the state capital to play for Corinthians in the first division. Palmeiras, in the next year, he switched local allegiances and moved to Palmeiras, helping the club successfully defend its league championship in 1994. In both 1993 and 1994, he was honored by the authoritative publication Placar magazine with the Bola de Ouro for the best player in his position. Deportivo, before the 1996 Olympics, Palmer announced that they had signed Rivaldo and his teammate Amaral from Palmeiras. After the Olympics, there was a dispute, and rather than Italy, Rivaldo moved to Spain as he joined Deportivo La Coruña plus or minus a in La Liga. He only stayed for one season, but nonetheless it proved to be a successful one for both him and the club. Rivaldo was the joint fourth top goal scorer of the season, with 21 goals from 41 matches, as Deportivo finished third in the league. Rivaldo switched to FC Barcelona in 1997 in a transfer deal securing Deportivo a 4,000 a million pesetas transfer fee. Barcelona, in his first season at Barcelona, Rivaldo was the second top goal scorer with 19 goals in 34 matches, as Barcelona won the double of La Liga Championship and Copa del Rey. In 1999, he won another La Liga title with Barcelona, as once again was the league's second highest scorer with 24 goals. Rivaldo was named FIFA World Player of the Year and won the Ballon d'Or. After Barcelona's unsuccessful Champions League campaign, Rivaldo was linked with a move away from Camp Nou. Then Manchester United captain Roy Keane was reported stating Rivaldo was the player he most wanted United to sign. In his third season at Barcelona, Rivaldo fell out with manager Louis van Gaal, when he insisted playing as a playmaker rather than on the left wing. Even though he had a strained relationship with van Gaal, Rivaldo went on to score 10 goals in the season's Champions League as the club reached the semi-finals. Van Gaal was fired in June 2000. In the following 2000 Euro 01 season, Rivaldo was once again the second highest goal scorer of the league, with 23 goals. 
in the last game of the season, against Valencia CF, Rivaldo scored a hat-trick to win the game 3 a Euro 2. His third goal was an overhead bicycle kick from the edge of the area in the 89th minute of the game, and is regarded as one of his greatest goals ever. The win secured Barcelona a place in the 2001 Euro 02 Champions League. After the game Rivaldo stated, What happened tonight has been incredible. I dedicate the winning goal to all the players who have fought so hard all season and all the supporters who have suffered so much. I'm delighted to have made them happy with my goals. He scored a total of 36 goals that season, taking his Barcelona tally up to 130. Milan, in June 2002, Van Gaal returned to manage Barcelona. Rivaldo was released from his contract, and signed a three-year deal with the Italian Serie A club Milan. With Milan, he won the Coppa Italia and the Champions League in the 2002 Euro 03 season. After leaving Milan, he briefly returned to Brazil, playing for Cruzeiro in Belo Horizonte. Olimiacos, on July 22, 2004, Rivaldo returned to Europe, joining Alpha Ethniki Division Club Olimiacos. During the 2004 May season, he scored some amazing goals, one of them coming in his first derby against Panathinaikos where he scored arguably his most famous goal in an Olimiacos shirt where he scored a free kick to send Olimiakos to victory over their eternal rivals. Another notable goal by Rivaldo came the following week in Olimiakos match day 6 UEFA Champions League group game in England against eventual champions Liverpool FC, where he scored a deft free kick in front of the cop and put the Greek giants ahead. However Olimiakos were eliminated after Liverpool talisman Steven Gerrard scored with a 25-yard half volley three minutes from full-time. In the last game of Rivaldo's first season at Olimiakos, the club needed a victory in order to win the Alpha Ethniki Championship, with Panathinaikos just one point behind. Olimiakos went on to beat Ireklis Zero a Euro 1 in an away match in Thessaloniki, thanks to Rivaldo's goal, and secured the championship. Rivaldo renewed his contract with Olimiakos for a third year, despite now being 34 years old. In July 2006, Rivaldo announced that the 2006 Euro 07 season with Olimiakos would be his last in Europe, before returning to Brazil. However, he quickly changed his decision and decided to stay for another year. The 2006 Euro 2007 season saw him score 17 goals in 27 Super League matches. Rivaldo scored 43 goals in 81 games for Olimiakos. AEK, Rivaldo was released by Olimiakos after the chairman of the club decided that he was too old to continue with the club. Later that summer, he signed for Super League club AEK. On May 29, 2007, his first Super League goal with the Athens club came through a penalty in their 3 Euro 0 win against Paninios. Rivaldo had another great season and the team initially finished in first place in the league, but after the court case between Apollon Calamaria and Olimiakos for the illegal usage of a player in the 1 Euro 0 Apollon Calamaria win earlier in the season, Olimiakos were awarded the three points in a court hearing, thus finishing two points ahead of AEK, Bunyodkor. Rivaldo announced on August 25, 2008 to a Greek sport radio station that he agreed to continue his career at Banyodkor in Uzbekistan, effective immediately, after what he described as an extremely tempting contract offer. Rivaldo signed a two-year contract worth a 10.2 million and later signed an extension to extend the contract to 2011. On his debut for Banyodkor, Rivaldo scored both goals and a 2 0 0 win. In 2009, Rivaldo became the first player in the world to score one, then two, then three, then four goals in four consecutive matches. He scored one goal in the first match and two goals in the second match against Nevejha. In the third match on June 25, 2009, Rivaldo scored a hat-trick against Metalurg, which was beaten for a Euro zero by Bunyodkor. In the fourth match Bunyodkor beat Sogdianajzak 5 a Euro 0 and Rivaldo scored 4 in 17 minutes. After the end of the 2009 season, Rivaldo won UFF Topscorer Award, having scored 20 league goals, 
and was runner-up for UFF Player of the Year award. He scored 33 goals for the club in total. Rivaldo announced on August 11, 2010 on Twitter that he had cancelled his contract with Bunyod Call. Moji Mirim, on November 18, 2010, he announced he would be returning to Moji Mirim, the club that he had started his career in the early 1990s, through his social networking site, saying, After sorting out a lot of things outside of the country, I have decided to play the poor lister 2011 for Moji Mirim, of whom I am president. However, he joined Zar Poundo Paulo in January 2011. Zar Poundo Paulo, on January 23, 2011, Rivaldo joined Zar Poundo Paulo. He scored on his debut for them in the first division against Linens with a wonderful goal. The ball was sent over from the left hand side of the pitch, before Rivaldo controlled the ball and took it over a defender using his left knee, and finished at the near post. He spent most part of March 2011 tending injury, but came back for following fixtures such as a 1 Euro 1 draw with Palmeiras and a 2 Euro 1 win over Corinthians. Rivaldo stated on his Twitter account that he would leave Zar Poundo Paulo by the end of the season. I just want to inform everybody that on Saturday, it's going to be my last training session at Zar Poundo Paulo. I've been told by the club's official that this is going to be my last season here. He added. I'm not saying goodbye to football yet. I still have a lot to accomplish. I just wish I could hang up my boots at the end of 2012. Cabascorp, Rivaldo joined Angolan club Cabascorp in January 2012. On March 18, Rivaldo scored a hat-trick against Recreativo Carla. On March 23 it was reported that English League One club Charlton Athletic had turned down the chance to sign Rivaldo on a free transfer. Rivaldo left Cabascorp in November 2012 after the expiration of his contract. Zar Pound Ocatano, on January 2013, Rivaldo joined Zar Pound Ocatano, signing a deal that ran to December. He scored his first goal for his new club in his debut against Sport Club Corinthians Paul Lister, February 9th. During the following match against Club Atla Copyright Tico Bragantino Rivaldo once again scored, although his team lost with 2 a Euro 1. In November 2013, he left the club due to knee problems. Moji Mirim, on December 2013, Rivaldo joined Moji Mirim, signing a deal that ran until 2015. He's currently the president over the club, and his son Rivaldino also plays for the club. Rivaldo only made one league appearance for the club. Retirement, in March 2014, the Brazilian icon officially retired from football after a career which spanned more than 20 years, and he decided to remain as the president of Moji Miram to help run the club and to look after his son, Rivaldinu. In a released statement, Rivaldo commented, My history as a player has come to the end. With tears in my eyes today I would like to thank God, my family and all the support, the affection that I received during those 24 years as a player. International career in 1993, he debuted for the Brazilian national football team, scoring the only goal in a friendly match against Mexico. He was selected to represent Brazil at the 1996 Summer Olympics. The Brazilian team won the bronze medal, but Rivaldo was not selected for the third-place playoff. Rivaldo returned to the Brazilian national team for the 1998 FIFA World Cup, where he scored three goals including two in the three Euro 2 quarter-final win against Denmark. Rivaldo had not been a part of the victorious Brazilian team at the 1997 Copa Arma Copyright Rica tournament, but was part of the successful defense of that title at the 1999 Copa Arma Copyright Rica. Rivaldo finished the tournament as the top scorer, with five goals. One being an equalizer from a free kick in a two Euro 1 win over Argentina in the quarter-finals, and two in the three a Euro Zero victory over Uruguay in the final. He was named the most valuable player of the tournament. Rivaldo had been the center of criticism when Brazil did not win tournaments, ever since the 1996 Olympics. In the one a Euro Zero win against Colombia in November 2000, Rivaldo was booed so heavily that he threatened to retire from playing for his country. The zenith of his national team career came at the 2002 FIFA World Cup, hosted in South Korea and Japan. 
featuring in an attacking trio with Ronaldo and Ronaldinho, dubbed the three R's, Rivaldo scored in the first five games while Ronaldo scored in four matches. Despite a successful tournament, Rivaldo was involved in a controversial incident against Turkey. Near the end of the match, with the ball out of play, Turkish defender Hakan Ayansel kicked a ball towards Rivaldo, who was waiting at the corner flag. The ball struck his thigh, but Rivaldo fell to the ground clutching his face. The referee sent the Turkish player off with a second yellow card. After a video review, Rivaldo was fined 11,670 Swiss francs by FIFA. Rivaldo's goal against Belgium in the second round prompted Belgian coach Robert Wasage to name him as the deciding factor. Ronaldinho assisted Rivaldo to score the equaliser against England in the quarter-finals before Ronaldinho scored the winning goal in a 2-1 victory. Brazil met Germany in the final, and went on to win the tournament with a 2-0 victory, courtesy of two goals by Ronaldo with Rivaldo involved in both goals. The first came after Rivaldo's shot was saved by German goalkeeper Oliver Kahn with Ronaldo scoring the rebound, and the second saw Rivaldo fool the German defence with a step over as the ball ran on to Ronaldo who finished. Rivaldo was named by coach Luis Felipe Scolari as the best player of the tournament. Rivaldo along with Ronaldo and Ronaldinho were named in the FIFA World Cup All-Star team. Rivaldo's last cap was on November 19, 2003 in Curitiba in a 3 Euro 3 draw with Uruguay. He played 79 minutes before being substituted for Luis Fabiano. He had scored his last goal just three days earlier from the penalty spot in a 1 Euro 1 draw with Peru. In his time with the national side, Rivaldo won 74 caps, and scored 34 goals. World Cup goals, career statistics, club as of March 12, 2014, International. Honours, Club, Palmeiras, Brazilian Zar Copyright Rae, 1994, Campeonato Paulista, 1994, 1996, Barcelona, UEFA Super Cup, 1997, Spanish La Liga, 1998, 1999, Copa del Rey, 1998, Milan, UEFA Champions League. 2003, Coppa Italia, 2003, European Super Cup, 2003, Croatia, Campeonato Mineiro, 2004, Olimiakos, Greek Super League, 2005, 2006, 2007, Greek Cup, 2005, 2006, Bunyodkor, Uzbek League, 2008, 2009, 2010, Uzbekistani Cup, 2008, 2010, Brazil, Confederations Cup, 1997, Copa Arma Copyright Rica, 1999, FIFA World Cup, 2002, Umbra Cup, 1995, Individual, Brazilian Football Museum Hall of Fame, Brazilian Bola de Prata, 1993, 1994, FIFA World Cup All-Star Team, 1998, 2002, World Soccer Player of the Year, 1999, One's Dog, 1999, Ballon Dog, 1999, FIFA World Player of the Year, 1999, Copa Arma Copyright Rica 1999 Top Scorer, Copa Arma Copyright Rica. 1999 Most Valuable Player, Spanish League Footballer of the Year, 1999, UEFA Champions League Top Scorer, 2000, IFFHS World's Top Goal Scorer of the Year 2000, FIFA World Cup Silver Boot, 2002, FIFA World Cup All-Star Team, 2002, FIFA 100, Greek Championship Best Foreign Player, 2006, 2007, Uzbek League 2009 Top Scorer, References External Links, Scorer's Way Profile, Rivaldo a Euro FIFA Competition Record Rivaldo at national-football-teams.com